everyone it's Susie from Dragonfly Bees I'm an online reseller primarily in jewelry and in this video I'm gonna show you what I found from Savers I went back there found the several items and I want to offer them to you today at subscriber discounted rates so if there's anything that you may find you like and would like to purchase just email me at dragonflybees at gmail.com now let's see what I got okay to start off we have this puppy what is he a Scotty he's on a gold tone setting and he's got this silver textured um, body and head he's got a little bow but I don't know do you think it's the collar is missing a couple stones here I still think it looks cute so let's take a look at the back he is not marked and he has a C clasp so yeah first one off is little Scotty brooch next is this gold tone butterfly are those eyes <laughs> I just realized that um, is the body there's this uh, ruby, faux ruby red rhinestone right there. It has these textured wings and then um, polished gold tone center and top. That is the back. No maker on this one either. Very sweet gold tone butterfly. Next, we have this really beautiful cat. It has black rhinestone eyes and a nose. It's got some whiskers. The body is like a polished gold tone, but there is some texture. The head, the head is completely covered with these rhinestones that are like a greenish yellow color. Um, round rhinestones all around. Let's see. They're all there. And then he has these little um, teardrop shaped rhinestones for ears. This is a um, very well made brooch. Let's look at the back. Um, okay. As you can see, look in the head and behind the ears. They are foil back rhinestones and here is the um, huh okay I know this cat but unfortunately looking at the um, maker's mark it's pretty faded. Um, this cat is made by Pell P-E-L-L uh, the Pell Brothers, they were, um, this is vintage. This, this cat's, well, this cat's from the 70s, but that company was uh, founded in 1941 by four brothers, and they uh, had a real wide assortment of jewelry that was mostly silver-plated, and um, they were based in Long Island City, New York, and they designed for Disney and also um, the Miss America competitions. And um, they even collaborated with Coro. Coro is another a uh, vintage, vintage costume jewelry company. So yeah, th this this um, cat is in really great condition. has some weight to it the back looks great except for like I said there is a maker's mark on the bar uh, P-E-L-L but it's really um, worn I mean you could barely make the L one L two L's I mean I guess it was quite loved and worn but 
The front looks great. The back, it's just that maker's mark that uh, that is kind of worn off. But here we have a 1970s Pell cat brooch. Oh, the, in the 70s, they also had one with just the head. So picture it with just the face. Um, but this one has the body. So this one is a, is a full cat. A pell cat, that is. Next up, we have this little birdie. It's a hummingbird. It is gold tone, textured. It has that little eye and the long beak. But there is some uh, wear on the orange enamel wings and also on the tail. Uh, this, I know this bird also. This is originally... Um, well, it's a uh, Jerry's. This is a Jerry's hummingbird. And originally it would have some black on the tip. Or here and here and some here. And the eye, I remember, would also be black. So I guess that paint wore off. I mean, I guess you can see some of the black maybe. Yeah, there's some black here, but it would have been, yeah, there's some black there. It would have been some black, like uh, just little tiny streaks. And over here, just along the tip um, and on the eye. Okay, let's look at the back. Here's the back, and... Um, it's really hard to see, but right there, um, it would it says Jerry's. So this is a okay. Let me show you the size. Look how tiny that is. It's a little Jerry's hummingbird brooch. There you go. Now you could see it well. Next, I found a bunny. Look how long its ears are. It's a polished gold tone bunny. And it looks like it's squatting because those are the front paws and those are the back feet. And um, it's got this like surprised face, even eyelashes. It's all in a uh, gold tone. The eyes are, it's just uh, kind of like sunken in. And on the back, there is a mark, and it says ART, A-R-T. So this is a gold tone ART bunny rabbit brooch. Next item came in um, its original box, and it's made in Thailand. When you open it up, It's a brooch, and it's this amazing crystal encrusted fish. It's made by Morgan Taylor, um, made in Thailand, and uh, this is vintage. Morgan Taylor has been around, oh gosh, I, I think 70 years. Uh, they're based in um, Vegas. <clears throat> this fish is in pristine condition. It, I don't think if it's ever been worn. Um, there's the mouth with the little black rhinestone eye and look at that shine. <clears throat> His fin wraps around and there's this detailing on the fin. This is the back. And um, it's funny though. There's no mark, but it's quite substantial in weight and it's quite long in size, but it's really a very um, nice fish in excellent condition. Next up is this very pretty 
gold tone textured butterfly with a faux pearl in the center. There's the back. This also has no maker, but it's still very pretty. Here we have another butterfly. This one is silver tone. It has purple rhinestones on its wings and red and green enamel on its body and head. Let's look at the back. There's the back. Now there is a maker on this one and looking at it, it looks like an H I, I think. I don't know. Have you heard of that before? Yeah, like an H I. Anyway, there you have it. Silver tone, purple rhinestone butterfly. Okay, so those were the things from Savers, and I figured, why don't I make it an even 10? So I grabbed some more things from my cell pile, and here is this really tall, very nice cat in this, like, abstract design print. It's in this silver tone design with the... Um, it's, it's raised... It's a raised design, so you do feel the texture on it. Uh, this is the back. And it is signed, too. So let's take a look. This one says JJ1988. <clears throat> so this is a JJ1988 uh, cat brooch. Okay, lastly, I wanted to bring this critter back out again. Uh, this one's a hedgehog. As you can see, silver tone. He's got little pink ears and pink feet. He's got a little black rhinestone eye and a black painted tip nose. There's all these um, little textured spikes, I guess, but they are rounded on top. There's the back. He's not signed either. Oh, but you can wear him as a pendant. And he has a C clasp. So yeah, little hedgehog. He's silver tone with the pink ears and pink feet. Okay, so that wraps up this quickie pop-up sale on my little new animal menagerie. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please give it a like and subscribe if you haven't already. And don't forget, if you're interested in anything, just drop me an email at dragonflybees at gmail.com. And don't forget, thumbs up too. Thanks, everyone. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.